it going there gamers my name is Lucy and I am back to bring you the top three things in the gaming world you may have missed over the past week so let's get to it number one of this week is unravel you've probably seen this little red creature kind of cropping up on social media you may have seen him kind of just knocking around all over the place especially in the game stores and this is of course Yanni, he's our little uh, fabric protagonist of the story Unravel, which has just come out on PS4. So I first kind of was made aware of this game uh, back in PlayStation Experience, was a few months back, and I was very excited to see this little cute companion just kind of swinging his way through Scandinavian backgrounds. It all looked very cute, and it is very cheap at the moment. It's only fourteen pounds ninety nine. So for something that looks that cute and that much of a beautiful story with such a great soundtrack as well, um, I think that is a bit of a steal. Number two of this week is another PS4 charmer that has just been released called Firewatch. So Firewatch is basically about a man called Henry. He wants to escape his troubles and he goes off uh, to work as a fire lookout in the wilderness. But this is a mystery adventure game. It's not all as it seems. So it looks really interesting from all the countless fantastic reviews that I have read. Um, it looks like I really want to put some playtime into this. Also, $14.99 again. What is with these amazing steals at the moment on games? It's incredible. And number three is not exactly gaming news. I'm going to admit here, it's a bit of a stretch. Um, yeah, I wouldn't really class it as global gaming news here. But you may know now, if you've been watching these top threes for a while, that I am a big fan of PlayStation. I do love my PS4, love PS4 games. I'm a big Sony fangirl, I will put my hands up. This is a big step for me because look what I have just bought. I've realised that I'm going to be doing a lot of travelling this year and I'm going to be waiting around places and I need some time to kill. Thus, dun 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 dun, this is a 3DS XL. Yes, I have gone and bought a Nintendo console. This is a huge step. I picked this up in Game Guildford, so big shout out to my Guildford guys over there. For £99.99, .99, brand new 3DS XL with Pokemon X already installed on it. Couldn't resist, that was calling out to me, this absolute bargain over here. I just had to get it. And to be honest, I am having so much fun on Pokemon X. It's unbelievable, but I'm very new into the Nintendo world. If any of you guys out there love a bit of Nintendo and you want to give me a little bit of a heads up on what games I should be buying for my 3DS, please do leave your comments below. I would love to see what games I need to get. Somebody has already mentioned Animal Crossing New Leaf and um, Zelda Ocarina of Time. So if you've got any more suggestions, please let me know and I will get on game.co.uk and I will stack my games up for this. I love it. Oh, it matches my lipstick as well. <laughs> all right then guys that's it from me for this week but as always i will see you next time with another top three keep on gaming have a great weekend bye bye for now